This video will demonstrate child immobilization by three providers using a child immobilization device. The first provider maintains neutral inline stabilization of the patient's head and neck. A second provider measures for and applies the appropriate sized cervical collar. The third provider places the long board near the patient. While the first provider kneels above the patient's head and maintains neutral inline stabilization of the patient's head and neck, the second provider kneels alongside of the patient between the patient's shoulders and hips and straightens the patient's arms and legs if needed. The third provider will place the immobilization device alongside the patient on the side opposite of the second provider. Once in place, the second provider reaches over the patient and places one hand under the patient's shoulder and the other hand under the patient's hip. On command from the first provider, the patient is rolled onto their side facing the second provider. At no time should the patient's clothing be used to grip and move the patient. The third provider can now place the immobilization device against the patient's back with the top of the board just above the patient's head and holds it in place. On command from the first provider, the patient and immobilization device is lowered onto the ground. Once on the ground, the patient's chest, pelvis, and lower extremities are secured to the immobilization device. Once the patient's chest, pelvis, and legs have been secured to the device, padding, if needed, can be placed under the patient's head to maintain neutral alignment, and then the head can be secured to the immobilization device. 